Hello all, welcome to my channel. Today we will discuss about how to write the first program in Kotlin and how to download the editor to write the program of Kotlin. So first of all, you just need to go to the URL that is jetbrains.com slash idea download. So I'm just moving to this particular URL in my browser. Here you can just go to this particular URL that is jetbrains.com slash idea slash download. If you are a Mac OS user, then just go to Mac OS tab. If you want to download the Linux, then you can go for the Linux. I'm using Windows, so I'm just selecting here Windows. Here there are two versions. One is the community version and another one is the ultimate version. If you want to do a program of Java, Kotlin, Groovy, Scala, Android, then all you can do using the community version. And the community version is free. So I'm just downloading the exe file of community version. So whenever you just click on this download, your download will start shortly. You can just choose the folder in which you want to download this. I want to download this in on my desktop so it will be downloaded yes now my file is downloaded once this file is downloaded you can go to that particular folder that is so in a folder here in this folder you can just right click to your application and you can just run as administrator now it will ask you, do you want to allow this app to make the changes to your device? Yes, you can just click on yes. Now it will just launch the screen. So it's just asking me click to next. So I'm just clicking on next. Here you can just choose the folder in which you want to install this particular program. I want to install this in my eDrive development directory. So I'm just choosing the directory that is this PC. Here you can select the folder in which you want to store. I want to store in as eDrive and that is development directory. So I'm just choosing the eDrive development. Once your path is choose, you can just click on next. Here you can just select dot Java and dot Kotlin. Then you can just click on next. Here you can just click on install. So the software will be installed. Please wait while Intel J Idea Community Edition is being installed. It is extracting all required files. So once the setup is finished, you can just click on finish. Now you can just close this particular window. Then you can just simply go to your menu and here you can just open the product that is just recently added that is Intel Idea Community Edition. You can just click over here. Then it will simply Ask me for the do you want to import the settings or do you want to configure the installation directory? I don't want to import any settings. So I'm just putting OK. It will be started. Now it says that welcome to Intel J idea. Now do you want to create a new project? Yes, I want to create a new project. So I'm just clicking on new project. Here, what kind of file you want? I want the Kotlin file. So I'm just choosing the environment that is Kotlin environment. Here you can just click on next. Now it is just asking me for the project name. I'm just providing the name of the project is my first Kotlin project. You can just click on finish. Yes, so it is open now. You can just maximize this. Now it is giving me some hint that is tip of the day. If you require a tip, then you can just uh, click on next tip, next tip, next tip. Or if you don't want the tip, then you can just click on don't show the tips and then you can close this. Now I want to create a one simple program of Kotlin. So how we can do this? Now here in SRC, you can just right click new, you can click on the Kotlin file you can just choose the file option over here and you can give the name of your Kotlin file is for example test so this is my test.kotlin file here you can directly write the function main and here in a function main you can write the code for example I'm just writing println this is my first Kotlin program once it is done you can just click on run run test kt file and you will get the output over here that is this is my first Kotlin program. 
Now I want to simply show you one object oriented programming demo. So I'm just taking here one class that is class test and here I'm just declaring one variable that is variable name colon and the data type is for example string. Now I'm declaring here one function that is function and the name of the function is for example display and here in display I'm just printing the message that is println and I'm just printing here message that is a hello and that is dollar name. So whatever has user has passed over here that I want to print. Now here in a function main instead of directly printing that this is my first Kotlin program I will just call the function that is you can just write taste and then you can just provide the name. For example I'm just writing the name that is Parag and here you can call the function that is your function that is display. Now you can simply run this run test Ketty and you will get the output and the output will be what that is hello Parag. So you can say that this is the simple object oriented version. So that's it from my side. In the next video we will talk about Kotlin in more detail. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.